guys, today I'm going to show you how to get game center on your iPhone 3G on iOS 4.2.1. So um, first thing what you've got to do is you have to have it jailbroken and have the city installed. And then you go into Big Boss and you go into GC Patcher for iPhone 3G. You don't actually need the um, source for it as it will already be installed on your iPhone. So once you've got that, you install. Once it loads. Sorry about this. And confirm. So I'm just recording this off my iPod Touch. But what this does is it is a repo of Cydia. But um, it works really functional. I've had several iPhones on 4.2.1 and it's worked every time. So, thumbs up for it. Sorry about this, it shouldn't be too much longer. Let's go up and restart your springboard. You'll have to restart your springboard, obviously. It's actually um, pretty quick. This uh, wouldn't take too long once it's restarted the springboard and everything. And, um, so, what happens? I'll put um, the source in the description. You have to have an source. Uh, add, sorry, you have to add a source on Cydia. It's quite easy to do. What you do is you wait for Cydia to load again. And this is say it says you get um, game sent in AirPlay, but well, I don't really know what the AirPlay is, but it does work. Okay, sorry about the bad handling, I'm not really used to videoing in one hand and doing stuff in the other. So mine's still on the big boss. I'm going to back out of it. And you're going to edit and add. And what the source is, is Cydia. Dot my repo space dot com forward slash i mark mark cool i mark ninety forward slash and add source so I was probably gazing off a bit there but um, I'll put the source in the description, so don't worry. So once this is all done, which I should have actually proved that I've got an iPhone 3G you know, on iOS 4.2.1. But trust me, I am. And I'll show you once I've done it. I'll give you all the proof I need for it. So you re and it reloads all the data. Hopefully, don't need to restart the springboard again. Because as you saw before, it actually took quite long before. One phone. So, pretty good weather here in Invercargill. Here it is, return to Cydia. Okay, so now you'll have the iMark 90 my repo space on your Cydia. Tap into it. Put down Game Center and AirPlay. And still, don't worry about it to load, as it does it anyway. And confirm.
I've got another video on this, but this is the one that actually shows you how to do it. And the other one wasn't a too good a video either. Neither is this one, but it, at least it shows you what to do. As you can see all the finger marks through this lens on my iPhone, so it's not too good. Shows I need to clean it. Um, once you've watched this video, stay tuned to my channel, you should um, comment and subscribe. I'm not too good at making videos, but if I get some comments on it, I can make me improve from it. Um, I'm going to make one coming up on if you've got your iPhone 3G on the white door firmware for iOS 5.1 and how to restore it and put it onto 4.2.1. Since I had a couple of problems with that and eventually I got it to work. It took a while but it's actually not that hard once you know what you're doing. So you should stay tuned. It shouldn't be too much longer now. Just so past the seven minute marker. Ah, that's just something I've been waiting for. But he is actually pretty awkward. Alright, so you got that done, and then you restart Springboard. No, it's going to be a little bit bumpy here, but I'll pick up my iPhone. Near this game center, so you're going to settings. I think you have to reboot your device, but you just go down to GC Patcher and you have it turned on. And if you want to work it with all your games, you just click on for all of them, whichever ones you want to work with it. And to prove on an iPhone 3G 4.2.1, go to about, I'm on version 4.2.1. And it's grey there, so it's an iPhone 3G. Once you've done that, you just go into Game Center, and there, Game Center for iPhone 3G, iOS 4.2.1. Please comment, rate, and subscribe.